Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Mario Plus Rabbit's Kingdom Battle. In the last episode, we had cleared out all of the main storyline levels in the first world of Ancient Gardens. And in this episode, we're going to return to Ancient Gardens for a special uh, trip. We are going to throw ourselves into Area 1. Because what we're going to do is we're going to be looking for movable blocks as well as challenges. And I'm going to do as many challenges as I can in World 1 with the amount of health and levels that I've obtained in this first challenge. You can do challenges whenever you want. You can come back at the end of the game when you have the top equipment and the top skills and all the different the skill tree stuff. Or you can come back as soon as you want and just take them on one at a time. In this particular one, we have defeat 14 enemies. Now, I definitely am going to need to go into HQ. I think I'm going to attempt this with uh, Rabbit Luigi and Luigi. Going into weapon selections, we do have a couple of weapons we could upgrade to, but I think I'm going to stick with what I have available. Upgrade characters to their steampunk weapon when applicable, if applicable. Like with Rabbit Peach. And this. Okay. The most important part is this. The skill tree. And the reason why is because a lot of the stuff that I'm going to be doing will require specific builds. That I don't even know how I'm going to do. So we're going to stick with the characters that we have to use. So what I'm going to do is... Grab Mario with that. None of these will improve my abilities. I could put points into Gold Shot so that I can make more money. Uh, M Power would be great. And that's, that's basically it. I could... We'll grab the Jump. Uh, Rabid Luigi, we're going to grab that, and we're going to get Weaken, and we're going to get, let's see, the times two dash, and we don't need the cleansing jump. With Luigi, we're going to grab the Sentry, and the increased Itchy Feet. And let's... Uh, that's another... It. Okay. So I think we're going to stick with those. So we're going to attempt this. So what we're going to do is I have to defeat uh, a lot of enemies. Let's go to Empower and make all of us stronger. Let's uh, dash and jump. No, nope, can't jump where I want to go with that. So I think I'm landing here again. Uh, before that. Okay. Let's weaken all the rabbits on this side. Slide through these two. And let's get Rabbit Luigi into a safe location. About here. Yes. 
Next, we're going to use Mario. He is going to dash, jump off uh, Luigi, jump here, and land here. And now we're going to use the hammer. Over here. I'm sure there's a couple golden shots triggered. This was a golden shot. Surprisingly, not as many as I thought there would be. Okay. So next, let's... Dash attack you and land here. Next, we're going to uh, Sentry Bot. What if I target that one? I'll get rid of that one. Let's. Yeah, Sentry Bot. The close one. Fortunately, I'm out of range. Then we're going to... Yeah. Steely Stare. And blast that one. And this should defeat him. Oh, no, it did not. It was close. Uh, but the rabbit did... Hold, please. Hey, Evan. What's up? On the phone with, uh, someone. I don't know. You're on your... Okay. 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 We love you. Bah. Okay, so we have a couple of options. Let's go dash and dash. And let's end up with a jump over here. And the reason why we're doing that is because we're going to uh, set up... Oh, mm. We don't get the ju jump. jump this way up and we're going to let's let's deal with these guys up here him sweet we got that now we're gonna use Luigi real quick who can dash attack that's a low dash attack so him and let's go here so that we can uh, divide and conquer the other rabbits. It doesn't, as long as if we, I think it's as long as if we don't kill any of our hero characters that we win the challenge. So now we want Luigi using... Let's go... Wait, do I not reach? Yes, I do. Let's get rid of... Seven. 
And we're going to excellently hit a critical. And we're going to barrier our barrier so that Luigi will, or Rabid Luigi will take less damage. We're going to, uh, I think we're just gonna skip because we don't need movement when we've already moved. That's 20 damage to Mario. This is, oh, he's shooting Luigi. Okay. This is gonna be another dash attack Mario and shooting, uh, Rabid Luigi, that's at least something. Fortunate for me. Another dash into Mario. And I don't know what he thinks that's gonna do. Uh, we are now with Luigi. Let's go with... Uh, with the... Oh, too far away. Shoot. Okay. That's okay. Let's, uh, Mario jump over. Jumping over, and let's go bop on the head of this rabbit. That'll destroy those two, and then we have one left with uh, Luigi Fire. And we need one more. Uh, we'll do it with regular Luigi right here. Blast. And that's gonna be the first challenge. Now, I'm just gonna cut for a f uh, moment because there's just something I have to deal with. Uh, but for you guys, it's gonna just continue right after this. All we have to do is complete the challenge. We don't have to do anything else. We get two extra points and some extra coins, and that's all going to help us improve our weapon selection against uh, the rabbits. So I'll be right back. Okay, we are back. Hello, guys. Uh, sorry for the cut. For me, it's been probably a few hours. Uh, we have this. I recognize those blocks from the basement. I hope they're more structurally sound after the super merge, but I doubt it. Okay, so I think that's still on the same detail. I believe as well... That that is the exact same model... From, yeah, because there's the white pipe that we went along. So it is the exact same model as later on. Just goes to show that this is literally a connected overworld. Where they will reload geometry just to make a point. Okay, so. I'm just running around collecting coins. Because coins... Will mean a lot. Uh, I don't think there's anything around. Because we've already collected all the box treasures. I think. I kind of wish there was like a map when you completed the, the overworld. We've been over there. Just gotta find... Yeah, cause that drops us. Ah, here we go. Challenge number two. Easy. Stay behind cover for full or partial. Okay, so escort Toad uh, six turns. Toad needs to move all the way to that point. We haven't yet had a Toad mission. This will be good for Mario, Rabid Luigi, and Luigi. Right off the bat. So we want to actually start with Luigi's... Uh, this move. And Toad cannot jump. So Toad has to make the run himself. 
Next, we're gonna get Mar... Uh, Rabbit Luigi, actually. We'll get him to slide. And slide. And, like with Toad, uh, no one can team jump off of him. So keep that in mind when uh, making plans. We will send Rabbit Luigi along with Toad. As like a protector. Let's get Mario going. Put him in between and we'll give him the hammer. It'll knock out all three of these guys. And now with Luigi. Uh, oh no, did I mess this up? A little bit. It's okay. Luigi will come over here. Okay, there is no one left, so let's skip. Okay, starting off with Toad. I really wish Toad could move on his own. Like, added movements. Okay, let's get Rabid Luigi. Uh, how far can Mario go? To that block. So let's plant Luigi here. Let's get Mario to slide, jump, jump, go back with Toad. And Rabbit Luigi will go slide and slide, team jump, even farther. Uh, next, yeah, let's do... Perfect. Okay, make sure everyone had moved, and... Tactic Cam. Okay, so now we have four. So... I think it's because Mario is in the way. Uh, Toad, we're gonna move. Yeah, there we go. Okay. So we're gonna slide, slide, team jump here. Now, if I do the hammer, those two are dead. Luigi is out of the shockwave. So let's get that taken care of. And now we can still even move so we can slide. Let's see. But let's do this actually, slide. And land. And then with Mario, we're gonna slide, team jump, jump off the rabbit, and land back here. And then with Rabid Luigi, we'll blast him. And with Luigi, we'll blast him. So far, we've annihilated every single rabbit that has been popping up. Which is good. We like doing that. Okay, we have a smasher on the field now. 
So the best thing would be to get Luigi or Rabbid Toad where Mario is. I can weaken the Smasher, which I think I'll do. And then Mario. Luigi will trigger this. And then Mario will trigger... This. Then we're gonna slide... Jump. Jump. And let's land... Here. Okay, next. Activate the vampire. Because what I'm about to do is probably really bad. Blast him here. And then here comes Luigi with his shot. And Mario. Okay, Toad. Okay. Oh, movement first. Okay. Snipe shot. And then with Mario, we take down this guy. Ooh, critical too. Okay, all we need of Luigi is to shoot one of them. Hopefully that worked. Quit. Okay. That did not. Well, this. Well, it worked now. And now, we don't even have to fight the rest. And that's our second challenge cleared. So, as you can tell, some of these challenges really take a lot of logic and forward thinking my favorite is coming up though and it's my favorite because i don't think even coming back you can do it it is a bit overly complicated you have to make it to the end in a single motioned move we got ourselves baffling blocks. And with this. Hey. 
We're blasting off to a rather unknown area. I don't even remember seeing this. Rabid Luigi's 3D model. We rotate that around. Where exactly are we? Oh, we're raided by uh, Challenge 3. Oh, this is it, actually. Super enemy effect is always 100%. And the idea is that a hero lands there. So... That's not what I wanted. That's also not what I wanted. Okay. Give me a moment. I'm actually gonna need some help. Okay. So this skill actually requires a little bit of retro thinking, really. We want these two to have no special power, to be honest. And we'll start. Bring Rabid Luigi, or this character, as far forward, and aim for the back. Now jump to Mario, come here, and just shoot him. And that's it, because now this guy will target Mario. Almost kill him. But hey, I made the leap. It is possible to do it other ways uh, when you have, again, more skills and abilities. But that is the way that I have discovered uh, to be a quick way to do it while we're still building characters and building points. So, that is challenge number three. I'm positive that there may have been a missed block back here. No. Because before that was Toad was lost. So let's keep going. We've cleared the challenge. 
Don't need to go that way. We came down from there, so now we're going this way. And... We are keeping our eyes open. We are approaching Chapter 4's area. Oh, look! All in one. I think this was a defeat them all in one turn. Which I do have to reintroduce my abilities. Yeah, defeat all one turn. There's only four? Yeah, there are four enemies. So, let's reintroduce our big weapons. And now let's look at the skill tree. We got 16 for Mario. So, what do we want? We do want might, we do want hammer, we do want the jump off. We still don't have to worry about this point. With Rabid Luigi. Still don't have to worry about that. Uh, ooh. I think I would want to build on this, but I need more points for it. Okay. With Luigi, we can now get double jump. So we can jump farther. Which... Actually, is that really important at the moment? Considering I don't have the points to do steely, multi-steely stare. Because um, I need 60. Yeah, that's probably the best thing to do. Okay. We're going to stick with the duo that I have. And let's fight. So, let's start off with you. And you. And let's end... Here. Next with Luigi. Let's slide. I think I want to land here. Because what I'm going to do next is slide, jump, and land here. Okay, what I want to do now is activate Steely Stare. Let's go. And... There we go. Shoot him. Yes. That failed. I kind of have the right idea, but Mario does honey, which means that the Smasher isn't going to start walking, which is what I need him to do. I need him to walk for Steely Stare. So, starting off again, let's do you here, here, and back. No, because that guy is blocked. I need here. Next. Slide, 
jump, jump. Back here. Next. Slide. Actually, out of curiosity. Okay, that's both. Steely stare. Shoot him. Let's do another restart. Because I think I know where I want to throw Mario. This is actually really challenging. Because you, you have to think outside of how can I do this in such a way that does A, but rather how can I do it in such a way that does B. Let's move here instead. Mario next. It is still going to be a dash. Jump. Jump. To here. This is still gonna defeat those two. Okay. I need to do that because... Of this. Slide and land. And then this will finish off the match. Because as he moves, here comes Mario. With a crit. There we go. That's another uh, challenge completed. Who? These are getting difficult. I believe there are 10 challenges, so one of the maps actually doubles up on challenges. Ignore low battery. Right here. Surrounded. 
What exactly is this? Defeat all in four turns. Okay. Well, I'm pretty sure I should have some new skills. Really? I mean, this is still good. Let's get extra movement from leaving pipes. Oh, Rabbit Luigi still doesn't have that because I was using this. I need to defeat all, so multiple slides is still the better move. Okay. Here is hoping we have a good team. Okay, so first and foremost, let's jump to Rabbit Luigi. He gets out, and he can only slide dash one at the moment. Is that the same with regular Luigi? But regular Luigi actually is different. Give me regular Luigi, because he has this. better to, to move. Mario's four slide does get him two. So what I can do is I can get us going in one tunnel. Start us off on one side. So let's get Rabbit Luigi going over there. Here is first slide and let's land... back here for cover and it's good to start with rabid Luigi because of the vamp dash with Luigi let's get him going he's going no Mario is gonna go next I should have powered everyone up first It's okay, I'm not going to... So I want to dash one. Actually, how much is dash doing? 20 and jumping does 30. Let's land here. And then Luigi will come out, jump, jump, let's have him back here. Okay, with this. Really, only one? But it does do full damage. So that's one, two. Oh, yeah. If I might the two of us. Let's hammer. So that's one. Let's do Steely Stare. Against who would be best? Let's go for you, because, yes, critical. 
Oh, push moved Mario away. That's weekend. And then let's do a bomb against those two together. A lot of this is tac tactical placement. Because now the chain chomps will go. So that's half of one smasher. And half of this one, who's weakened. Oh, guess Chain Chomps don't uh, take on that added effect. We are going to fast forward. Ooh, Smasher. Okay. And these smashers shouldn't get close enough. Okay. So, start with Rabid Luigi. He gets one dash here. And we can smother... Ooh, genius. This one. Back at the other side. Ooh. Dash. Jump. Dash. Jump. This will kill. That's what I was hoping for. Pushed him back. Than that. Okay, attack the camera. We have three enemies left. Okay.
Okay, if I play this right, I should be able to get this guy defeated by that end of the turn. So, I need... Dash, escape, to Raytheon. Cannot dash in time. Dash. If I jump, same distance. Here. You are defeated. And you're gonna be defeated. And that's how we can do it that way. Didn't even have to hit that last smasher. Battle is cleared, all healed up. Is this, uh, no, it's still only two points. I think there are some that give off a lot more orbs, but for now that's what we've got. Okay, so because of how brain filled this episode has been, we've got Toad Friends, what level was this? Challenge 5. Since we've cleared Challenge 5, we're going to demonstrate with what? Okay, five orbs. Uh, oh, we're over here. And music. Okay, so since we've cleared challenge level five, we are 90% positive we're going to end the episode here. I do just want to demonstrate what this does because we probably waited for so long to show what this is. We are not going to do it this episode or even next episode. This is the special stage which is a after final battle area that requires the world's ability to access. Every world has one. It is the chapter chapter 10 of the world and I'm just backtracking because I'm positive that it's gonna be a challenge back here really I was positive that it was going to be back here little guy waving a flag no Really? Huh. Well, I guess I'm going to find where chapter 6 is first before we call it an episode. Just because there's going to be a lot of chopping up of things. Maybe. I don't know if I'm going to chop up the between areas. 
and just make it into a here are the challenges or if you're going to see me fumble around obviously if I explore a new area you're going to see that on camera if I get new items you're gonna see that on camera but if I'm just traveling in a zone of my own silence this better be six okay it is six so then that is it this is gonna be our episode thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys so much for watching this episode of mario plus rabbits kingdom battle i hope you've enjoyed the first five challenges of this uh, first world as we keep going they are going to get harder hopefully not to the extent of stage of challenge number three where it's literally a brain aneurysm of what am i supposed to do how am i supposed to do this we have challenge number six here we're going to get all the way up to the final challenges and then that's going to be it for the gardens, we do have the secret level, and that's going to be in a different episode, so keep your eyes out for that. If you liked what you saw, you can always leave a comment in the comment section below. Mash that like button, and subscribe if you have not for more Mario Plus Rabbids content. I'll see you guys in that next episode. Bye. <laughs>